Hey guys, Chaos Fox here. Um, so today I'm going to be doing a review on a wig from Wig Supplier or Roll Cosplay. They go by both names. Um, first of all, here's my package. Oops, upside down. Um, it says Le Email or Le Email Wigs or something like that. I'm not really sure how to pronounce it, but if you see the websites over here there's roll cosplay and i think wig suppliers on oh it's over here it's kind of ripped up though wig suppliers over there too first of all um i love that it says everyone can cosplay over here sorry i keep i keep doing everything backwards with mirror images on camera um but yeah everyone can cosplay and it's true, everyone can cosplay. Okay, so first of all, I'm going to go over a little bit of wig maintenance and also kind of like stuff like how to wear your wig and stuff. So it comes like this in this packaging to keep it nice and safe. Open it up. Try to be gentle with it. You can remove this piece right here, the white piece. Oh, they, they were nice and sent me a wig cap. <laughs> I'm happy that they sent me a wig cap because I have no idea where mine is. Um, but you would essentially put your wig cap on and look like a maniac because wig caps and me are weird. I like these ones, the ones that are open netted because you put them over your head and then you go like this and you kind of just grabs all the hair for you. kind of hard to do this on camera. I'm used to doing this on a mirror. Ugh, I look like the food lady at school. <laughs> but anyways, you put it on like that and you tuck in all your hair. I know some of my hair is hanging out. It's just that I can't see really that well right now, but yeah. And then I would give the wig a nice fluff kind of when you pull it out. Just fluff it up a little bit. And then they have little connectors on the inside so that you can um, basically connect it. You just put it through the loops and then it resizes the wig for you. It can go from really small to really big. And this actually has a really adjustable cap size, um, these wigs. I thought they were going to be smaller because of the fact that they're from China. But it's actually pretty big for a Chinese wig. Um, I really like that. Overall, my first impression is that I really like the fibers. They're nice and soft and silky, and they're not super, super shiny or anything like that. And it has a really cool color, and it's like mixed with different colors because you can see like the highlights and stuff in it. So let's try it on. Oops. So this is kind of how you put a wig on. You look silly putting it on first. And then there's tabs on the sides. You use those to center on your head so that you know the wig is centered. So this is the Felix Argyle wig. I'm going to post a link to it. Um, it was $7.99. And that's without shipping, so that's really, really cheap. $7.99 for a wig. That's 8 bucks for a really cute wig. And yes, I'm going to eventually cosplay as Felix, because he's cute. <laughs> but um, it just needs a little bit of trimming, of course, and the um, bangs. But that's usually normal. What wig do you buy? anywhere that doesn't need some styling kind of have a small head so he kind of wears his hair more like this uh, something like that but okay yeah if I had to give this wig uh like um Sorry, wigs do tend to shed a little bit, 
This one's a little bit more on the shittier side, but I think it's because I just took it out of the package because now that I pulled away a couple of the stray hairs, it stopped shedding. Like, it's not shedding anymore when I'm brushing through it, as you can see. I think it just had a couple of stray hairs in it, and I might have yanked some off, too, when I um put it on because I can't see what I'm doing too well. Um, Yeah, if I had to give it a review, like, uh one to five I think I'd give it a four and a half it's like almost perfect but not quite there but it's almost perfect and that's like really good when it comes to um my standards for wigs yeah okay stay tuned for the next reviews guys because guys because I'm going to be doing a bunch of reviews coming up like of like contact lenses and stuff like that I forgot to mention one thing, so before I go, there's a 10% um, off coupon code because this wig was sponsored, but I'm being completely honest about the review because I've ordered from them before they even decided to sponsor me, and also if I didn't like it, I would just say so. <laughs> I'm not obligated to say that I like it, basically, but it's, I mean, you can see the proof. Um, so just use Chaos Box Costuming for 10% off of your order, and I'll definitely put that below as well.